working out but of course I've got to go places I've got things to do so a lot of times I have to get ready very quickly after the gym even though being all sweaty and gross so to help myself usually before I go to the gym I always braid my hair it also just kind of keeps it out of my way and it also waves my hair so it's just a good hairstyle for me for the gym now dry shampoo is going to be your best friend my friends and I personally love Clorant dry shampoo they have a bunch of different kinds and I'm going to use a couple different ones in this video to show you how they work so of course I'm going to undo my hair and you can see how gross my hair is I also hadn't washed it for four days because I wanted to prove a point now first I'm going to use the natural tint Clorant dry shampoo in my hair and I am super generous with dry shampoo. I spray a ton of this in my hair. Now the reason that I love Clorant dry shampoos in particular is because the active ingredients in these are plant based. Meaning that they're good for your scalp and they don't clog your pores like other dry shampoos tend to do. So you can see I'm very very generous and I wanted to show you how well this works into my hair so I actually worked it into my hair for the purpose of this video but usually I leave this in and let it sit and absorb the oils for as long as possible I usually spray it on and then hop in the shower but because I want to show you how easily it rubs in I did that now now that I've got my hair kind of situated for the time being it's time for a quick shower and by quick shower I mean an actual quick shower not a long lengthy shower like I usually take Ain't nobody got time for that when you're trying to get ready fast for a hot date. After my shower, of course, it is time for skincare, and I'm not going to get too in depth with my skincare routine because I have full videos on this. And if you want to see an updated one, let me know down below or give this video a big like. But I usually just kind of slap it on when I'm in a hurry. I actually got it in my eye right there. <laughs> So don't do that because it did hurt. <laughs> so I just apply it very quickly <laughs> and move on from there. And then I let my hair out so it can air dry a little bit if it needs to. And I usually just throw on a dress when I'm in a hurry because I like that they look classy and dressy, but you can also make them look casual. I just think they're a good option. And now I'm going to start on my hair because I have so much of it, it is the first thing I have to deal with. Now, I'm going to go back to more dry shampoo because I want more volume in my hair because, hello, I have a hot date. Now, for this, I'm using the Clorant Non-Aerosol Dry Shampoo, and you can see this stuff is pretty nifty. And out of the dry shampoos that Clorant has, I feel like this one gives a ton of volume. You can see, again, I am super generous, but it actually still rubs into my dark hair, which is another thing that I like about this dry shampoo is it blends in really well with my dark roots. And so after this, you can see, woo, look at that volume. Now I feel like bangs are easily where you see the grease and the sweat after working out. So if you feel like they still look greasy, I would recommend a hairstyle that kind of pulls them back. Now I've done this hairstyle before, or at least I kind of showed you guys. But basically what I'm doing is twisting my hair in a French braid style, except instead of using three sections, I'm using two sections. I'm kind of terrible at explaining hair stuff. I'm just not very good with hairstyles. So I slowed it down there so you kind of see what's going on. And then as I pin it back, I usually push my hair up to give it even more volume. So you can see it's a super cute hairstyle that gets your hair out of your face and pretty simple to do. Now for the bottom part, I'm gonna quickly curl it in giant chunks. I can do this relatively quickly. I can easily achieve this hairstyle in like two to three minutes. So this is something really quick and just clean looking. And then I like to spray the bottom of it with a little bit more dry shampoo to give it more texture because my hair tends to lose a curl really easily. And it also just makes my hair smell nice, you know, so my hot date doesn't smell with stinky hair if I don't wash it. <laughs> Also, I want to know, you definitely don't have to curl the bottom of your hair if you just don't have time. Usually when you kind of pull the top half up, it still looks nice and clean. I just did this because I had a hot date. So, 
And I also wanted to note this, you can actually use dry shampoo as deodorant in a pinch if you're in a bind, you can't find your deodorant or something, you got your dry shampoo, just don't get it on your clothes. But I'm gonna go ahead and pull my bangs out because it's just kind of my signature look to have it down like this. And now it's time to move on to a natural look for the makeup. Not that kind of natural. At this point, you probably only have one to two minutes to do your makeup. And I would just recommend doing a couple things to kind of clean up your look. So first, of course, fill in your eyebrows very quickly. Mine are actually microbladed, so I just did that for, you know, viewer purposes. And for my skin, I'm actually just using concealer where I need it. I'm not gonna do a full face of foundation, so I just apply my concealer underneath my eyes and on some pimples I might have or marks and just quickly blend it in with my fingers. Now, of course, you want some flirty lashes to bat at your hot date. So I'm just quickly applying a coat of mascara just to kind of define my lashes and define my eyes. And then following that, I'm going to apply a cream blush because number one, I can apply this with my fingers and I feel like it just has a natural glow to it. So it kind of makes your skin look healthy and that you're just naturally blushed and you know, very naturally pretty. <laughs> And then finally, I'm gonna dab on some red lipstick so it lasts all night and I feel like red lipstick just kind of makes it look like you put in more effort to your look than you actually did. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and got some tips for getting ready fast after the gym. I just also wanted to let you guys know that March 12th is National Dry Shampoo Day. To celebrate, Clorant is actually giving away dry shampoo on their Instagram, which is linked here and down below as well. As always, I hope you guys are happy and healthy. And don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe, share with your friends and family, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys!